Hi, this is Sahana. In this session, we are going to write C sharp program that will search for a specific string. I have created console application. In first step, I'm going to ask the user to enter main sentence or even you can call it as string. As it is console application, we are going to make use of console window for input and output. To print the message on the console window, we can make use of console.writeLine method or console.write method. Let's ask the user to enter string. Now he will enter string. We are going to store that string in a variable. It is going to be string type variable and I'll name this as main string and we can use read line method to read input from console window. This method will return a string and we are going to store that in main string. Main string is ready. In second step, we are going to ask the user to enter search string. Again, we are going to repeat the same thing. We, are, we have asked the user to enter search string using write method and we are storing that input in search string. We have used read line method to read the input from console window. Both the strings are ready. Next, we are going to search for a string. To search for a string, let's take this main string and we are going to make use of contains method. We are going to pass search string. If search string is found inside main string, then this contains method will return true, else it will return false. Now we are going to declare boolean type variable and we are going to store result inside that variable. Final step is to print message on console window. We are going to write if condition found is true, then print the message on the console window string found else we can say string not found that's it it's a very simple program let's test it now let's enter a sentence now we have to enter search term see now we have a message string found let's test it once again this time i will enter a term which is not inside this sentence i'll say not t we have a message string not found it's working i hope the session was useful see you soon in the next video thank you